you Gemini's what is happening for you Gemini's this month is the energy of water you are here be aware of what is transpiring in this month Gemini so let's go in and see your reading remember to become a member of the channel and you can receive the extended reading Gemini's 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 abundancy is coming to you guys okay so let's see what's coming out for you Gemini's in the first week you have the energy of strength whatever the issue and the situation is you have to find inner strength to deal with the issue now whenever the energy of strength comes up it is a fire energy it is going within to find the strength to deal with a situation that is going on around you this month have four weeks then we have the energy of the jet the 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 energy of uh, negative forces negative people coming at you in the second week so be aware of what is transpire because you have to find inner strength to deal with this so you guys have two fire energies that you're dealing with go and check out the extended reading the third week you have a judgment call whatever this judgment call is we're going to be looking to see is it positive or is it negative for you gemini so third week is an emotional week where information is coming out then you have the energy of uh, people in power so some of you could be receiving energies from your manager your boss your supervisor people in that power or it could be information coming out about your father for some of you so be aware of these energies so there is no supporting energies for you Gemini's in this month because of what is transpiring there is the um, there's some hardship that you have to deal with in the first week and the second week so be aware of that let's go in and see what is happening in the first week you have strength and the second week negative forces and it has to do with the mother of one so whoever this person is this person is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius 50 years and older so you're dealing with this forces that is coming at you but you're going to be standing your grounds against this person stand your grounds against whoever this person is so then we have um, the energy of uh, the nine of wands you need to protect yourself against negative forces and situations that is coming at you because this is the center of your month now whatever is transpiring and whatever the forces is you need to protect yourself against this then as you come to um the third week going in the fourth week you have the energy of a pisces cancer or a scorpion person whoever this person is it could be a boss a supervisor um, it could be a situation with your mother and your father that you're going to be receiving some news about okay so whatever is transpiring be aware of the situation that is coming up so in the second week you're dealing with negative forces and there is heartbreaks heartbreaks that is coming up for you Gemini's in the second week you're de dealing with negative forces you're dealing with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius person who is creating negative forces in your life Gemini's you got to be aware of this in the third week you are going to be receiving information about a cancer whoever this yeah it can be a Pisces cancer or a scorpion whoever this person is you could be in a relationship with this person or this person whatever news is coming out um, you are going to be finding out something about this young cancer then we see the outcomes of this month is the ace of cups new love is going to be coming in for you Gemini's so whatever is transpiring I see that you are going to be having new love your burdens you need to protect yourself and new love is going to be coming in I see you Gemini's are going to be heartbroken um, with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion whoever this young Pisces cancer or scorpion is you guys are in a relationship with this person and I see heartbreaks is coming up heartbreaks is coming up uh, and you need to protect yourself because this Pisces cancer scorpion that some of you are in a relationship with 
it's um, very negative and it's using negative forces so you got to be aware okay very deceptive person she is working with an um, a Sagittarius woman that is creating negative forces around you let's see what is transpiring so we have strength that is coming up and um, you're going to find strength to deal with an issue in the first week and it has to do, do with that you're seeing the truth about an old woman she is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius you're seeing the truth about this old woman she's an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian the negative forces have to do with some of your inner relationship with a Pisces Cancer Scorpion and this person is using negative forces to control you you're going to be finding this out Whatever is transpiring, it has to do with the person you're in a relationship with you, Gemini. You are going to be finding out that this person is using witchcraft and that sort of a thing. Now, this woman comes up and there's a judgment call about this woman. Who is this woman? This woman could be someone you're in a relationship with or it could be a, a mother figure. This woman could be also someone in, um, in, in, that has power. It could be but a judgment call is going to be coming out because they realize what she has done so a huge judgment call is going to be coming out in the um second the third week going in the fourth week because someone has overused their power the truth is coming out about deceptiveness and a relationship that you're in and deceptiveness with a sagittarian person whoever the sagittarian person is uh, um there is deceptiveness that is going to be coming out and showing up this person for what they have done i see the ace of pentacles is coming in and some of you are going to be finding out that you're in a relationship with someone and this person is only in the relationship for money and you need to protect your money and protect yourself you gemini's this person is really deceptive so I see you Gemini's are going to overcome an issue with a Pisces cancer scorpion woman whoever this person is this person has worked with a, um, a older woman that is a Pisces cancer or scorpion to do some deceptiveness and it is all coming out now here we go you are dealing with these two older women one is an Aries the or Sagittarius one is a Sagittarius one is a Pisces cancer or scorpion and there is heartbreak for the one that is a, a cancer. Whoever this woman is, there is heartbreaks for her, heartbreaks that is coming in. Then you have a situation that you're dealing with an Aries Lee or Sagittarius. This Aries Lee or Sagittarius man is connected with a cancer person. You're going to be finding out some deceptiveness that they have been doing together without you knowing this is someone who you know as a friend transition is coming up with a new love um, some of you could be losing your baby if you're pregnant transition is coming up I see the energy of heartbreaks for you Gemini's okay so Gemini's ooh, and it's heartbreaks with a lot of money because you're going to be finding out that a Sagittarius person or an Aries person some judgment call is coming out about her and someone you're in a partner with so it could be your partner mother or fa mother and father that has done some deceptiveness but some of you know someone that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius and I see that they are working together with this young person and they're going to be found out for the, the deceptiveness that they have done okay um, they're going to be found be found out for the, the deceptiveness that they have done now the energy of uh, um, uh, negative forces uh, with your money you're going to be seeing the truth in the uh, first week going in the second week because it has to do with your home partner that is taking everything and invitation is going to be coming to you but be aware of this invitation because it's just someone who wants to deplete you of your money. New love is coming in. So I see new love is coming in. Whatever that is transpiring for you, Gemini, I see new love is coming in. Now, some of you could be um, falling in love with an older Aries Lee or Sagittarius or 
um, you could be um, this whoever is coming in is only in this relationship for money and it's as if your spirit guides is gonna wake you up and said wake up and see what is happening secrets are going to be coming out people in powers are going to be telling you what an old Aries Leon Sagittarius has done together with a, your partner a young um, young people have to find inner strength to deal with a situation um, because the truth is going to be coming out Wow let's see some of you are going to be finding out about a cancer and a Sagittarian for some of you an old cancer and a Sagittarian that has to do with some money some money was supposed to come to you and these two people have done some deceptiveness and I see they're caught they're caught so I see a corporation institute it's going to be paying you a whole lot of money and I see some of you are going to be receiving some money from an Aries V or Sagittarius because they found out that this man has been working with your partner and your heart is going to be broken not to worry you're going to be very very successful over the situation successful over a new love that came in um, there is going to be transition because the lies and deceptiveness of these people are going to be coming out ladies you got to be aware ladies if you are dealing with a man in a corporation institute say they are going to be finding out about some deceptive situation that this man has created and what this man has done wow Gemini it is really a month but the, the thing about it Gemini I see a whole lot of money is going to be coming to you and I see is as if people are going to be helping you to protect yourself from an old um, Aries Lee or Sagittarius person it can be an old um, Aries person and a Sagittarius person because Sagittarius person comes up so a lot of you are going to be dealing with with a woman 50 years and older that is an Aries or a Sagittarius and this woman has done some deceptiveness some of you could be meeting this woman in a relationship you got to be aware of this woman there's a lot of secret about this woman so stay clear of this woman money is in money and love I see money and love is coming up for a lot of people in um, this month so um, Gemini's this look like a good man I see a corporation institutes you a government institutes your corporation have to pay back some of you Gemini's some money because of some deceptiveness what a Pisces cancer or scorpion has done with an Aries Leo and Sagittarian they found out what they have done so I see heartbreaks some of you um, it's going to be finding out some that a couple that you're coupled up with is so it says these people are friends they could be older than you that they have used your information or use your 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 key or something to get um and um, buy and get success because you're going to be heartbroken because these people pretended to be your friends and then you're realizing some of you are very much going to be heartbroken over uh, older um, woman she's a Pisces cancer scorpion she worked together with a Sagittarian or uh, um, to um, take some money from you or get some money from you however they work together very very deceptive people um, you Gemini it's kind of a sad situation for you Gemini but um, it's as if some of you Gemini had faith in especially the couple that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius and the Pisces Cancer Scorpion but I see heartbreaks is coming up because you're going to be finding out that if this is your partner's mother and father that they're very deceptive and they only connected with you for money this is the time when the truth is going to be coming out about these people but I see you're going to be successful and um, um, someone is going to be helping you out of this situation okay so let's look and see which animals the beaver in the reverse um, let's see what animals are coming in you have to um, choose the energy of these animals whichever you choose that is the animal that you're going to be working with okay so we have the first energy of the octopus this is a water energy and um, it's as if you Virgos, uh, you 
um, are going to be help, getting help from Virgos. You, Geminis, are going to be having um, and doing thousand things at one time. Having the um, energy of the octopus to be holding on and to be um, clumping down on things that you see that is uh, being taken away from you. Where you are going to be using the smartness of the octopus. Seeing that the octopus has so much hands. You are going to be a being a thousand fold working in this month against an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius. The beaver is here. Another hurt animal um, or a fire animal that is just so powerful, so good. The beaver is here. And some of you, especially you ladies, are going to be taking on the energy of the beaver in order to work on a situation and to get out of the situation. And this is going to be good. Some of you, you're going to be finding out that a man 50 years and older is as if it's a beaver. I see government institutes and organization find out that your girlfriend um, that is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion, your sister, your friend was working with this man and they were um, accessing your information, your account and using it to profit for themselves. This is going to be coming out, but you're going to be successful coming out of this because I see a corporation, a government corporation, an institution is going to be helping you to get back some of this money. Um, I see some of you, whoever connects with an Aries Lee or a Sagittarius woman, 50 years and older, it could be your mom. It's all about money. This person wants nothing else than money. So Gemini's be aware of whatever is coming at you gemini's you're going to be very very successful so this is going to be your month where whatever is coming at you you are going to be very very successful you gemini's let's see what past life are you working on gemini's again we have two cards choose one of these cards okay so here's two cards so this is the first card this is the second card the first card say forgiveness. Forgiveness is going to be the keys, Gemini. Whatever the issue and the situation is, forgiveness is going to be the key because you, Geminis, are going to be having issues and forgiveness is the key with people in authority. Um, the, the second card is authority. So some of you, Geminis, have to have some forgiveness for people in authorities for what they have done with some deceptive move that they have made okay so gemini's it doesn't really matter you're going to be overcoming these uh, lies and deceptiveness what they have done forgiveness is going to be the key i want to say to you guys uh, please for the extended of this reading use the link below and you will receive the extended remember to stay clear of uh, the aries Leo, or sagittarius women um, they have secrets and they're only in this for money. It has nothing to do with work or anything. It's that it could be your girlfriend or your partner, um, mother-in-law or someone who's connected. Be aware of this person. Namaste. Until next time. Mm -hmm.